All right. That was fun. To sit in on. <laughs> to sit in on. To sit on it. To attend a meeting as an observer. Or to sit in um, for someone else. I'm sitting in for Sabrina for saw because she can't make it. I'm sitting in uh I'm taking I'm taking their spot basically you could say too. I'm sitting in on your lap. No, just kidding. <laughs> I come to sit on your lap. <laughs> I will die. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Uh, to sit in on, yeah, to sit on, observe. Um, I want to come and sit in on, sit in on and observe your class because it seems very interesting and I need some pointers. Um, I come to sit in on watching you cook because I'd like to learn how and pick your brain. So, yes, to sit in on your face. So, go ahead, saw. <laughs> great so that is the number seven to sit in on uh, this is a great business phrase of verb it's used specifically in the context of a meeting and when you sit in on a meeting it means you attend a meeting, but you uh, attend that meeting uh, that's an observer. So you're not going to participate. You're not going to present. You're not going to ask questions. You're just going to attend as an observer. So, if there uh, a really interesting meeting at work, but you not directly related to the subject matter, you might ask the organizer, uh, the example, is it okay? If I sit in on the meeting today, and which means you're just going to attend, to listen, to receive the information. You're not going to participate, participate. Or if you're planning a sales meeting, you might say, Example, it would be useful to have someone from accounting sitting on the meeting. So someone from accounting is just going to be there to, to absorb the information, but you don't. Ex you don't expect them to participate or present anything. So, very useful phrasal verb in a business context. <laughs>